This past year has been a roller coaster for investors, and there's a wealth of lessons that we could glean from it. So today we're going to be covering our 2023 recap with three lessons that we could carry into 2024. So first up, 2023 was a year that truly emphasized the importance of adapting to a new volatile macroeconomic regime. We saw U.S. stocks make a strong comeback, soaring high after their underperformance last year in 2022. This volatility wasn't just limited to stocks, though. Bond market performance also experienced its own turbulence with long-term bonds being particularly affected by essentially just flip-flopping market views throughout the year on potential policy paths for the Federal Reserve. The second lesson from last year is the creation of opportunities through what I like to call greater dispersion. So we observed a big variation in individual stock returns last year, which is a trend that's essentially been in place since all the way back in 2020. This dispersion is driven by a few factors. We've got macro uncertainty, geopolitical tensions, and structural shifts in the economy itself. Now where others see chaos, we can see potential. Diversifying your portfolio and being selective with your investments is more important than ever as we head into 2024. The third lesson revolves around all the buzz that it's been hard to miss created by artificial intelligence and its significant impact on US stock performance last year. So we saw the surge in tech stocks, particularly those related to AI or artificial intelligence, really underscores how major forces like technological advancements are influencing the market, not just in the future, but right now. Let's break down what happened performance-wise in 2023. U.S. stocks surged roughly 25% last year, depending on which part of the market you look at, which was almost a mirror image from 2022. Meanwhile, the 10-year U.S. Treasury yield ended the year essentially where it started, climbing from the lows of 3.3% in April to a near 16-year high, about 5% in October, before falling all the way back to 3.9% by year-end. These sharp swings in markets, I believe, are directly linked to the narratives that we saw throughout the year in that flip-flopping of what the Fed's policy path was going to be throughout the year. So as we wrap up, remember my key takeaways from 2023. We've got adaptability in a volatile market, seizing opportunities in dispersion, and lastly, the growing influence of technology across all stock performance. And whatever 2024 holds for us, we can be sure that this new regime of greater volatility, more zigging and zagging from day to day, is going to be here to stay. If you're a client, you've already received your personalized performance recap and net worth progress report from the last quarter. Um, in addition, don't hesitate to reach out if you do have any questions. As always, stay on point. Take care.